Hello, friends. This is Savage Sasquatch, and we are diving back into Neo. This is our playthrough, of, or let's play on the PS4. And we have found the first uh, checkpoint, the first shrine. This is not the first enemy I wanted to see, really, after... Um... Oh, gosh. Not the first enemy you want to run into. Alright, he's... Oh, no. <laughs> At least we're right by the checkpoint. Which might be necessary. That was a very fortunate dodge. I'm not sure if these guys come back, but we're going to find out, because we're going to pray at the shrine. Oh, yes, that's right, we're on a new continent, so... Uh, we're back to only getting three elixirs. We were living on five, which uh, was kind of high on life there. But that's not the reality here. We are on three. This is our... And this guy is back. Fantastic. Let's go chop chop. And you have no stamina, so we get a free hit or two. Shouldn't have uh, tried for two. Alright, this might do it for me. We did much better there, and hey, we're up to four elixirs. Getting back to some comfortable territory. I bet you this is a lock from the other side. Oh my goodness. I must have played this before or been to every other door in the game. What did he die from? Uh, cut down by wheel monk. So that's what those things are called. They're called wheel monks. I just hate them. Whatever. Oh! That was almost bad. I thought I was doing the uh, freebie move and <laughs> almost dove into the poison. It's interesting. I don't know if we would land down there or not. I feel like there's other directions for the time being. Let's go find those. Arrows. Or maybe just this guy. Well, that preserves some health, I think. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and get up here, and we will use an antidote, and... Oh, I didn't want to use that. I wanted to use that. Okay, we've got a victim right here. Or we might be one. That hurt. Try to get up here before... Oh wow, even this platform is getting poisoned. Yeah, we just used up three. Where did that guy go? Oh, there he is. Okay, we got one elixir back. It's not going to make up for the lion's share, so we need to move quickly while we're down here. And not fall down there. Oh my goodness. That's bad. Let's 
get out. I almost ran into the hole, but I just said, let's not run into that. We need to very quickly climb back up here. The poison is recirculating and percolating. Let's secure ourselves. Honestly, almost want to see what's the other way for just a second here. This is another one of those devious little holes into nowhere. I notice nobody's fallen here. There's no warnings. You're about to encounter this. Yep, here comes poison. Man, that's getting annoying. quarters much. I'm very aware that we have a very small window to get back down before this poison. Big plus side is, oh gosh, we got a drink down here. We were gonna die on the way up this ladder. So yeah, until we find the next little spore nest thing. might just be the one that was guarded heavily. Oh, we found another path. Oh, another Kodama. That's really good. Yeah, this will take us back up high, which is out of the danger of the poison. These guys blend in so well, like I even knew he was there and I had a hard time finding him. Oh, Moses. Oh, not where I want to. Gotta stay calm. Oh, let's grab another Kodama. Huh. So we're going to really be cheap here. So I remember finding this. Are they going to both seriously come over here? That is not cool. I'm curious how far back they're going to chase. Well, at least we died a death of convenience. We've got five Kodamas, we're right next to the shrine, and it's refilling us up to four elixirs, so it's not all bad here.
guy, like... He hurts nothing very well. Okay, I don't think that guy respawns. And we can... We can actually sprint past the, uh... The first one of those guys we've discovered, which is nice. Is those spinning fire wheel guys. Not cool. Okay, we can now explore this area in relative safety. There's a monster coming from the hall. Is this where we've been? Or is this a whole new... This seems like a whole new... Just a bit of terror here. Now we know that the, the fire thing, the fire wheel is going to burst through behind us here. Thankfully we already got all the items from it. Oh wow. I did not expect him to dive down there. little bit of poison and honestly that's fine we got a good chunk of health off of him okay we do have to make it back to our idiot machine back here Oh yeah, gotta love this. This is definitely the way not to do this. And we're gonna pop an antidote. Okay, and we're going to... Wow, that was a good hit. If we can dispatch these guys quickly and possibly find another... Oh, we got greedy. And oh man, the head was after us there. This looks so much like the starting room, I thought that it had reset us. Okay. We want to fight him in a safer place than on the boardwalk. Staggered, but I think we can get away. He's staggered. He's, oh no, that hurts. We're staggered again, but he likes to run into walls. I keep making the same mistakes. Manage our way up to five elixirs and promptly die. We did not get back to our body, so we were burning to death apparently. So confused. We definitely have to get rid of this guy. I want him to see us. So it appears that he has to be facing you to see you. I just picked up on this. Like, he turns to figure out where you are. He's gonna shake and blow up. 
then we can hit him. Okay. We're doing astronomically better this time. No, you have bad breath. I forgot that we simply needed to go down there. Well, there's still a cloud down there. The question is, does the cloud come from multiple directions still? before the poison comes back and gets us. Also, this allows for a great bit of diving. Maybe that wasn't the best way to do it. Maybe it was. You know what? We're going to refresh our machine before this poison comes back. It's already starting to come back, actually. But it hasn't risen, and we didn't lose health. Perfect. I don't think there's anything over here. It's all down this hallway, and it's going to be very difficult do without getting rid of the goon squad here. But we did it. Now we're going to uh, run around the hole here. Back up. Avoid the smoochy mint monsters. So far, I haven't seen any poison come back. So it looks like we have good stuff. Let's not die foolishly. We almost did. Oh, I'm staggered. Get back. when random alarms go off in the middle of a tense moment. Oh, I haven't seen him do that before. I have seen him explode like that. Heaps of gooey bad guy fun on a number of occasions, however. Okay, good. We're still on five elixirs. So I'm... We found that large room, and I'm assuming that a boss might be there. So I'm thinking that this area here might just be for finding more Kodamas and just interesting, useful items. So that's a bad way to go. I guarantee you this guy probably fell to his death. Yes. He ventured off into a bad direction. I understand. Like, you experiment in these kinds of games to a certain degree until... Well, when you don't find 
His body, at least, you do. So... Just for being thorough, I noticed that there's a ladder over here that we haven't kicked down. It's very possible that we've cleared this area out now. I feel like it is. That is the case. Poison to death, that's not going to be our fate. Oh. Bad guy fall down. Oh, boom. Let's regain our stamina or whatever the crap you want to call it in this game. I feel like that barely. That barely hurt. Where am I? Ah, I know where I am. You never know when he's gonna do that like five flurry thing that he does. Okay, another elixir up. I just saw this ladder here. I think we've been up here before. Yes. About where we're located. Or I don't really want to go that way, though. Great way to avoid fall damage. So it appears the only thing left here is to go check out what I would presume to be the boss. This room looked large enough that I'd be shocked if it was anything but a boss. Almost forgot about you, buddy, but don't worry. We're thoughtful. Don't want to forget about nobody. I probably am going to want to forget about what's in this room, but... Oh, well, maybe it's not a boss. I see lootable guys and all manner of poison down there. So we're going to have a pretty small window. I think we're going to drop down. We're going to attempt to... Oh, yes. We have found something bad. Really? Poison? Spiders? Oh. oh, no. That's not terrible or anything. Seems to be angry about something. You don't say. The Great Centipede. That is who we have found here. I'm curious what its recourse is when we go up here. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I like the idea of making him attack the pillar. Wow, that's very specific area that it's targeting. I am curious. So you can... I like this, though. We've learned that we can damage segments of him, which is really important. Gosh, that centipede is so long. See, we... 
eliminating little bits of centipede one by one. play this game for a while, buddy. Oh! Let's drink quickly. So this seems to be getting more difficult as the centipede gets shorter. Let's get away from that. The other thing I noticed is that one of those fan things machines is up here, and I'm curious what use that might have. So before he gets over here, we're going to try it. No idea if that's doing anything at all. Maybe later in the fight it'll become important. Let's throw a rock at him. Alright. He fell off there, so I wanted to take that opportunity to do get a hit in, basically. Nope. That hurt us. Not much. Maybe like 7-8% of our health. Finally, seen that we can stagger this. Get that much damage off. Of this way. Okay, the poison's here, so we've got to stay. More of them came back. using the 
this machine in the second phase of this fight. Or whatever phase we're in. Probably won't use them any more consumables. Might throw a rock at him here just to... Gosh, that thing is large. Uh, that's what she said. So the machine doesn't want to be refreshed yet. He's still got a ways to go. And we have no life to go on here. That's all, folks. All right, let's not lose heart here. We've kind of figured out the guy's weakness and how to exploit it. We're doing rather well. We almost killed him there, and it's a little disheartening whenever you have a guy on 5% health, and you play it a little too risky. But, oh my goodness. So this is going to be interesting. So it looks like we actually might be farming for elixirs here for a second, because we fell down. Went boom. Chop. That is a scary swing. Thankfully, it missed. Okay, we've got an extra elixir. It's a really good sign. him come to us. Fight on our ground. Don't fight around where you could fall into a hole. Come on, buddy. I'll throw a rock at you. Remind you I'm here. kind of sucks because I'm doing this not for the experience, but I'm doing this for the taste of it. Diet Coke. I am doing this because we need more elixirs, and what better way to get them than farming? stands there and takes it like a champ. Come on, champ. All right. We are... I'm feeling a lot better about this because we are... Well, I think there's a ladder over here somewhere. Yes. There should be another archer. <laughs> Nope, that's the other... I'm thinking of an old room. Don't mind me, gang.
not go up here where he can see us. Ooh. Close call. That's the one thing I'm not going to try to farm for an extra elixir. It might very well just go the other way against our favor. to the Nightmare Beast. Well, that didn't hit. He's fast. Knocked a couple sections off here. Oh, that staggered us, but we might be okay. Yeah. Okay is a very relative term here. haven't quite figured out the trick to getting the hits in on this guy, but he doesn't hit incredibly hard, as long as you dodge the big stuff. Like that. See, we get a big hit in, and he turns around, and he may tap us, but he's only getting a very small amount of health in. See right there? I mean, I'll take that trade on hits any day. Like, I don't even need to... It's one of the easiest hitting things in this game so far. And maybe therein lies the secret. down for the count. He's out of stamina. He's going to run away. We're going to get free hits in on him as long as we don't stand in front of him. Okay. This is a fairly safe zone. We've only had to use one of our six elixirs and he's down to half, so we're definitely... We definitely have a good handle on this fight. All right, here he comes. Wow. Holy crap, he's fast. Where are you 
going with us. Okay, we actually drove him away again, which is really interesting. I'm not sure why he went that quickly or what we did to get rid of his stamina. To that degree. Again, just a, really a tiddlywink of damage. Down here somewhere is the stupid little spore, and that's what we need to find. With our new axe, we two hit it. Let's clear away our poison. Catch. Oh, maybe not. Now you can catch. This might finish him off right here. Oh, we're getting a little too hasty. Trust. Me. We have beat the beast. It's well known that the yokai lash out the stronger the fiends grow, but I've never seen anything like this. Me neither, buddy. That was an incredible boss, though. Um, I gotta say, that's quite creative, quite different. And we managed to get through it. We're gonna go ahead and hop out here. What you've seen here is a um, edited version. I've taken a couple of the longer deaths out. Is it? We had some five to ten minute attempts on that boss, uh, but honestly, I think we got him down in about four or five tries. So that's not bad at all. Thank you for taking care of that business in Iwami. Now we should be able to resume our mining. I would appreciate it if you didn't tell anyone what you saw down there. No, I wouldn't tell anybody about that big worm. Who'd believe me? Keep it to yourself, and I can assure you that the Mori clan will be honor, glad to honor Master Hanzo's request as long as it remains advantageous for us to do so. If you wish further assistance from the Mori clan, I suggest you seek that dude who I will not say your name. Okay, this has opened up. Let's see, that's a main mission. That's a submission. That's a submission. All right. Well, we're going to call it for here for now. Thank you so much for watching. And give us a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And until next time, this is Savage.